Much of Scanny Atlas, a busy place in the summer, especially on a wonderful night like tonight. Well, I can tell you, Christy, it was certainly hopping when we were out there around noontime today, and that's a main reason why a traffic study has just been finished on one of the busier intersections out there. The Jordan and Fennel um, intersection, that's been a corridor of significant interest to the village uh, throughout the year. It's a busy and important mixed use area with several businesses and people living in that section of the village. Plus, there's lots of traffic, both cars and trucks, as well as visitors walking and biking through this stretch of Skinny Atlas. This was an opportunity that came to us at no expense to the taxpayers. and. Every community is interested in traffic studies, in potential solutions for, um, for the movement of people and vehicles through the community. Erickson says the study is non-binding, so they're not committed to any particular work. And he says actually right now they don't have any immediate plans for a project. But he says this information will be helpful in the future if they ever do. Different people have different interests, um, but everyone has an interest in making the village a place that that residents feel comfortable living in uh, and a place where visitors feel welcomed and feel like um, they are able to uh, enjoy their time. Now suggestions include things like bike lanes while maintaining on-street parking, adding bike lanes and increasing on-street parking and a third option would be a roundabout. Again, nothing in the works right now, but Erickson says a study like this done by the Syracuse Metropolitan Transportation Council could help the village with grant applications to help fund a project should it ever get that far with this board or future boards.